fan of Juicy Living with Tracy B and the Whole Food Marty Girl. And in today's video, I'm going to show you guys one of my favorite all-time salads. Um, being mostly raw, I eat heaps and heaps of raw um, salads, clearly. Duh. And so I'm going to show you guys pretty much what I have, I don't know, pretty much every single day. And I never get sick of the salad. It's just so, so yum. And um, it's around about three o'clock today in Melbourne. It's freezing cold out there. And um, I've just had a huge day treating and I'm hungry. So um, I'm gonna make a massive salad. When I say massive, we're gonna fill this up and we are gonna eat so much goodness. I cannot wait. So much goodness in here, so much. So when you eat raw food, you have to eat heaps. I don't mind, I love eating. So here we go, watch the space. So I have got, so I have got some beautiful fresh organic um, spinach and I've just cut the bottoms off here and you have to wash them because they're quite sandy. Um, and then under here we've got some cherry ripe tomatoes and um, some flat leaf parsley, which I love, or you can use coriander. I've got no coriander left, unfortunately. Ah, oh, but that's okay. Um, a lemon. Got some lemon and dressing tahini. And don't forget, avocado. So watch this as we load this puppy up. don't really like the stalk so much because they're just too hard to chew um, with the parsley but the spinach spinach stalks I use because they, they're just not as hard to chew and I tell each leaf that I love it and while I'm making my food here's something here's a tip here's a really weird tip when you are preparing your food, you want to ensure that the thoughts that you have going through your head are positive and happy because energy is transferable and it's actually transferable to um, your food as well. So we want to make sure thinking happy thoughts and your food will give you happy vibes. how simple and easy that was for me like I don't know that took me three or four minutes seriously this is my favorite meal of the day I just love the freshness and it seriously does fill me up it's so simple but seriously it is so satisfying and just so so fucking yum. I'm 
That was being a bit greedy. And the tahini, I prefer held tahini because it doesn't have a bitterness to it. So, um, mmm, mmm. A nice little variation too is maybe adding some cucumber and some coconut aminos, which give it like a, it's a dressing and it's a little bit sweet. Got some sweetness to it, but I'm happy. With just this. Mm -hmm. So if you like this video, you like this recipe, please hit the like button, share it with your friends, and make sure you subscribe. And we'll see you in the next video. Yep. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm.